Oh, hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to a game called Forts. You guys gave me suggestions. You said in the last video, like, hey, I wish you could figure out how to play with mods. So guess what? I've got mods today. Oh, <laughs> did you see that hit? That was fantastic. If I do it again, I can take out their other cannon. Oh, dirty McGurdy. Oh, that was beautiful. You just lost your cannons, bro. Hey, you know what else? There's another cannon somewhere else. And if I do a little bit of that, I might take it out. Oh, that is that is amazing. <laughs> yeah, so these are World War II warship maps, and I think they're kind of cool. Also, you might notice something right down here called Cluster Nuke. <laughs> we have Cluster Nukes on a World War II warship, so that'll be exciting. Are you doing things over here? I don't like whatever's happening, but we should probably get some devices and upgrades and stuff going on. Uh, I want to bring the nukes on the backside, so let's get a couple mines maybe in the front here. Put down two mines because I have a lot of money. Actually, by two, I mean I'm more than two. Then we're going to throw in a workshop as soon as I can afford it. We're going to put that right up here. And I could probably sell this too since we don't really need that. We have them on the front side. Okay, are you building weapons? That looks like you're going to build weapons. Um, I don't really know. Uh oh, that's not how I wanted you to shoot, but that's cool. Thank you. Thank you, game. It's kind of a waste, but whatever. Okay, we want the workshop, incendiary swarm missiles. We want, I kind of want the, we want the munitions plant, so I don't really know what you're gonna get, but getting flat cannons is never a bad thing. Speaking of bad things, let's, let's be a bad thing to them. Yeah, perfect. Oh, they didn't even have anything in there. It would have blown up if they did. Maybe I'll try this one too. No, I didn't really want, okay, whatever. Just kind of, ooh, hey, I hit the black thing. Nice. <laughs> this is satisfying already, and I haven't even done anything. I always like it when they give me free stuff to blow my, my enemies with. All right. Super mines going up. We're going to start getting a bunch of this stuff because we have to have a bunch of these things. And I do just want to keep my enemies kind of not shooting at me. like. So that means I need to blow them up better. Oh, beautiful cluster nukes. You know, I probably could just straight up destroy them. Because somewhere right in here is the center if I hit it a couple times. That's not as fun as dropping a nuke on him, though. Maybe I should fire some rockets. I feel like rockets would be good. And maybe a couple more flak cannons. Just in case they try doing anything weird. Very nice. Now I just need to save up 5,000 energy. Probably I could build a little higher and get regular energy things too, huh? That sounds... Whoa! <laughs> on second thought, let's connect this first. Whoop, whoop. You know, just working on the battleships in the middle of the Pacific Ocean and then connecting everything together. That's what we do around here. Slap on some more of these bad boys there. Build this up so our ship doesn't explode in death and dying land. Connect you and you. And then we'll bring you up. See how that works? I'm so good at this game. Said nobody ever. All right. I hate doing this, but we have to start scrapping these. And then I do need to get more and more of these upgraded. And we're going to have to get in a lot of batteries, too. Because if you noticed that this cluster nuke costs 20,000 power, and it's 28,000 every time I want to fire it. So we need to have a lot, a lot of windmills up in here. Also, the idea of wind turbines on... <laughs> on battleships in World War II sounds a little bit sus. Oh, those things just suck. Oh, because these aren't bracing. These need to be back bracing. Go away. It's a good idea not to put a wind turbine inside of like a little box. Yeah. But we can upgrade these. Very nice. We'll just upgrade everything and then we'll explode our enemies with cluster nukes. Okay. I probably need to hit them again. Although it doesn't really look like they're doing anything. Except whatever this is. <laughs> it's like a toddler with crayons. Fire the EMP missiles. Okay, you got a flak turret. We're going to remove that pretty quickly. We'll just do a little bit of this. And goodbye, flak turret. Come on, hit it. Oh, wow. I actually hit it. I'm impressed with myself. Now I can fire the missiles. I will take a nap and then fire them. Nice! <laughs> that was amazing. Oh, this game is so much fun. Why did I ever stop playing it? All right, we're going to upgrade those to real rockets. I could be using these up, but that's not nearly as fun. 
These boys are like, yes, we're spinning for days, my dudes. I'm gonna build this so big that it's just gonna fall over. Ooh, I have 29,000 money. Does that mean that I can build it yet? No, I need to get the technology. This is Napoleon Dynamite would say, I love technology. And I'm just gonna keep firing here, just to keep them annoyed. Try to blow up all their garbage, except it didn't work. So I'll fire a larger cannon. Ooh, that was nice. Something satisfying about large cannons in this game. Can I upgrade you? No, that's too sad. I can also buy the lasers. Lasers are fun. All right, so all this needs to turn into background bracing, which is gonna be stupidly annoying to do. I wonder if there's a keyboard shortcut. I really don't know. Oh, background bracing, how nice you are. Background bracing, you're so good. That was a bad song. I'm sorry, I won't ever sing again in videos. Oh, here, here it is. Cluster nuke, oh, 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 that's amazingly tall. That looks fun. Yeah, we're gonna turn background bracing here and here. Even though it's like, hey, we just want a little door. I don't even care. We're going back, we're going background bracing. There is no room for error when you're launching a nuke out of a, a ship. We're gonna make a missile silo here, and the enemy will have no clue what's about to happen. Quick, more wind turbines. I should probably reinforce the entire backside here because it looks like it's about ready to explode. Well, oh, that thing takes so long to build. Thankfully, they're incompetent and they forgot how to build things, so I can just launch my rockets at them. We're gonna try to sink them from the front side, even though there's probably nothing over here. Oh! <laughs> that was awesome. Do it again. Do it again right down here. Ready? Yeah. I want to hit this thing and just light the entire bow on fire. Oh! Oh, that sounds so nice. Do it down here. Uh oh. We have to clear that guy in the front. Oh, no! <laughs> I didn't really want him anyway. Okay, ready? Missiles, get in there, get in there. I feel like they probably have an equal amount or more mines going on inside of their base. Ooh, that was nice. Thankfully, they're not building any cannons or cluster nukes. I should put the Fort Ripper on the front. That's my nickname in high school, by the way. Look at that thing build. Oh, <laughs> that's so satisfying. Oh, wow. There's the climate toaster. The Fire Beaminator 9000? I'm not gonna lie, I kinda just wanna remove this thing and put it in a, like a plasma beam here. Something very fun about a plasma beam hitting a giant wooden ship, almost like this. Please don't blow it up though. Okay, that works. Oh, that's so cool. And it's on fire. I think the AI forgot how to AI in that one. But we almost have a cluster nuke. Oh, it just upgraded. <laughs> oh, it looks so fun. I want to play with it so bad. And you might be wondering what I'm doing. And then you're thinking to yourself, I know exactly what he's doing. He is building another nuke silo. I just have to take away all of the bracing and background bracing in here. Ooh, and I just heard our beautiful little uh, lasers on the front get finished. So I can put in another one right here. Oh, that's gonna be so much fun. I wonder if I have to have a laser cannon on the, or uh, a sniper. Let's try this and see how much penetration we can get. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay, we'll hit that same spot right here. And, uh oh, that wasn't quite the same spot, but that looks very nice. I really should have done one of those and one fire laser. Also the Fort Destroyinator or whatever that's called, this thing, Fort Ripper. <laughs> It's being constructed. Yeah, there's something kind of messed up about this thing. It doesn't go very deep, but it really destroys metal nicely. Oh, it works. The nuke is online. Oh, we need a sniper. Okay, I figured we would. Where am I gonna put a sniper at? Oh! Oh, oh it's ready. Okay, ready? And oh! Oh! Oh, I missed! Oh, I didn't quite all the way miss. <laughs> oh, that was fun. I do it with this thing now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. Those two together would be so deadly. And I'm just regenerating supplies so quickly because I've got a buttload of like the entire world at my disposal. All right, my friend, you're going away. We've replaced you with something much more powerful. Ah, just kidding. I don't really care if you're here or not. I'm putting the sniper up top. Oh, nice, we have the fire beam. Okay, let's hit the deck like that. And we're trying to rip through. And then I want to see how far we can get this laser to go in that hole. Mm, I missed. I really want to try these out too. But the good thing is we have the sniper so I can launch the first of the cluster nukes. Where should I launch it? Like right here? Yeah, we're gonna launch it right there. Oh, making big noises. I'm so excited. Oh, 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 oh. 
What is that? Oh, it's an ICBM. It went up into space. No way. That's amazing. Look at look at my ship just bouncing. Okay, it better fall. It better not blow up the entire ship at once because I totally want to play more with it. Let's surprise him with like a little, little laser in the front. And then we'll hit him with this laser too. Oh, I hear it. There we go. Okay. Oh, there it is. There's coming in. Okay, blast. Oh! Okay. That was amazing. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's so stinking cool. I just hit it with a cluster nuke. The good news is I have two more cluster nukes available pretty soon. Well, one, and then that one will be repaired about the same time that one's done. Wait. Oh, I burned up half of my own ship. No way. That's kind of cool in a weird sort of not cool way. Like the entire ship has radiation damage to it. So I should put in repair stations like everywhere. This thing's ready again. <laughs> I'm just gonna hit it. Why not, right? Oh man, it shoots so low. Okay, let's fire beam it. Bop, 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 bop. Okay, fire beam's not nearly as cool as the plasma bead. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, break off! Oh, that'd be amazing. We have a, we have a two nukes that are ready. <laughs> I feel like I need to fire both of them off at the same time. So guess what we're gonna do? If I fire them both at the same time, does my ship blow up? I'm a little bit scared about that. So we're only gonna fire once. We're gonna fire this one. Oh, it doesn't have enough power. I want to destroy that tower so I can hit the other side. So let's see if I can bust that up here. That's a little bit low. No! 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 I didn't want to win like that. Oh! Is there a save file? Oh, no. Shoot. <laughs> I wanted to launch the nukes again. So what happens if I just start a new map and build another nuke silo here? Or you know, the game will automatically change everything to background bracing for you. You don't have to spend 10 minutes doing it. Ha ha ha. Right guys? I'm not gonna lie, this looks like a pretty nasty ship, doesn't it? Like the entire core of it is just surrounded by explosive batteries. We've got gigantic cannons on the deck. We got two nuclear silos going up the background plus wind turbines. I don't know what is like satisfying about these wind turbines in this game but they just seem ominous to me like i'm scared of them not nearly as much as i'm scared of that nuke but you know what i mean all right should we try firing nuke number one or should we fire them both at the same time and watch both of our ships blow up i kind of think both at the same time while i wait for my lasers to work yeah and i took the top off like i exposed the entire core of this thing i can't i could <laughs> if i build super high up I could build and then hit the back side of it, but I'd have to have an angle that would go up to here. And then I'd have to snipe down to the backside. That's not gonna work. Ooh, but I think it's ready. <laughs> oh, two nukes are ready. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's just soften them up a little bit with a plasma beam first, right square into the nose of this ship. It's not quite the nose, but you know what I meant. <laughs> oh, is that gonna blow up? I want to see the battery explode. Please explode, Mr. Battery. <laughs> that was great. Now they're going to feel the real wrath of the Blitztopian Empire. Double the nukes, double the fun. Let's do this, boys. Paint the missiles. Right square on the core. And oh. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I'm excited. Now imagine that was a real ship. Oh. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Oh, that was dangerous. Oh. Okay, we survived. We survived. Everything got repaired pretty quickly. Oh, here, quick. Grab on. You'll be all right, bud. <laughs> oh, that was dangerous. And I love danger. Where are those nukes at? Where are the nukes at? There they are. There they are. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, that's so satisfying. Look at that ship and how destroyed it is. Oh, that's fantastic. <laughs> anyway, guys, that'll do it for today's video of Forts. I hope you enjoyed it. I did. This game's so much fun. Thanks for watching and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank everyone who signed up on Patreon, including Ben, Ellen Hagen, Dickie James, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Eagle Arc, Whip It Good, Seraphin X, Desbogger, Maxer, Sarnoff, Legacy, Jason McFarland, Deegan, 
Paul Longstone and Ralph, and everyone who has clicked that join button down below to become a YouTube channel member.